Well, good morning, guys. I just want to touch space. Maybe you're not watching this in the morning, so I guess good morning is kind of funny. Um, anyway, I just want to make sure we're clear on the final exam. So you guys, your final exam is 20% of your grade, so like two letter grades, kind of a big deal. Um, so it, it is next Wednesday on um, the, gosh, what is Wednesday, the 15th, okay? Um, and you'll be taking it at home. Um, you'll have to submit your work just like always. So you guys, every year we have kids who kind of use that what if and they're like, hmm, I don't really have to do the final. But as a little incentive, I just sent an email explaining this. If you score your grade on the final or better, and not just like if you got a B and you have a B plus, you got to get at least not the same percentage, but the B minus, you got to get at least the, B, the same thing, the same grade. Um, then you can get a 2% test boost on one of your final, um, one of your um, semester tests or one of your tests, your unit tests. Gosh, I hope I did a good job explaining that. My point was to make a video to help explain that. Then I also want to go over the agenda just to make sure you're clear what I want you to do to study for the final exam. So, um, oh guys, I'm getting a B plus in Puppet 2. So in the final, so here's the links for all these different things. Today is just a work day. So as you look at this on Thursday, there's no, not a live Zoom session. Honestly, because this, this is why. I think sometimes when you come to the Zoom sessions and you ask questions, I'm so happy to answer your questions. Your teachers are so happy to answer your questions. But you kind of don't have that productive struggle thinking yourself. And I get it because you're busy and you've got other classes and it's hard and you just want to get it done. But I think there's something to be said for actually persevering through a little bit of the work and like a little bit of the struggle. Not a ton. I don't want you to be overwhelmed. Trust me, I'm here for you. But I just want you to work on it a little bit. So today, no, no Zoom session. Just get started on the final exam. So this first one here, um, they each have 40 questions. I made a homework helper video, I believe, for every single problem. There might be two that I missed, but literally, if you get it wrong, you can watch a two-minute video where I work it out. So maybe you'll find the problems that like were a struggle for you, and you can look at those and watch the homework helper video, and it will help you. You want your teacher to explain it? Come to a Zoom. Reach out to me. I'm happy to help you, but I think the video is sometimes you're not reaching out to me, and I don't know if if you're getting the material, because sometimes I look at the test grades and I think maybe you don't exactly. So I sometimes look at the test grades and I'm like, dude, they don't even need me. So just want to point that out. So you've got this big practice and you've got a second big practice. They're both 40 questions. Okay. So if you pace yourself and you kind of just do 20 a day, that next week on Monday, there's a third one. It's, they're all open now for you. I would encourage you to do all three of them. Um, even though it might seem like it's a lot, but just pace yourself. Some of them are really short, like what's the conjugate, and some of them are a little bit longer, like the domain problems. So anyway, I just want to touch base and make sure that you're understanding where we are. Um, the final exam reviews aren't due until the day before the final, so you've got some time to get them done. So if you have something going on, that's fine, but we want to get them all done before the final next Wednesday. If for some reason you're not going to be out of town or unavailable, maybe you're having surgery, something big going on on that Wednesday, let me know because we need to make those plans ahead of time because it's kind of a big deal for the final exam. Um, anyway, I hope you have a wonderful day and um, go get them.